Hello, welcome to Geology classes. Today we are doing one more problem on issue of shapes. This is class 12 or if you want second PUC, anything is fine. We are doing accountancy in that we are doing issue of shapes chapter. In the old videos, you already learned when they issued at par, premium and discount. Okay, now we are doing for feature of shares. If they didn't make the payment, if any false scenarios are there, how do you treat them that we are doing? Right? In the at par already we have completed. At premium also completed. So now in this question we are doing if they issued at discount. If they issued at discount, how do you treat them? And if for feature is there that time, how do you treat? So that we are doing from this question. Okay, first let's check the question. What is the question? Total 5,000 shares are there and its value each one cost 100 rupees expense. Okay. And uh, how they have made the payments. On application 20. On allotment 30. First and final call 40. Total is how much? 40 plus 30, 70 plus 20, 90. Is it 100? No, it's not 100. That means they have issued a discount. Okay. They may mention this discount or they may not mention. Okay, if they mention or not, first to do the total, if it is more or less than actual price of the share, then you can make out if it is issued at premium or it is issued at discount. Okay, now here they have issued at discount, they mention or not mention, mostly it will be at the allotment, premium or discount, anything it will be included in the allotment itself. Okay, next 500 shares were not made the payment of first and final call and those shares were reissued at 75 rupees. Okay, this is the question. Okay, they didn't mention these are equity shares, preference shares or normal shares. Okay, whatever, whatever they mentioned that you write off. If they mention equity shares issued at, then in each and every journal you will be seeing only equity shares. Okay, bank account data to equity share application account. Equity share application account data to equity share capital account. If they mention preference, then we will be writing everywhere preference. Okay, for this one, shall we write down preference? This I am calling it as preference. Preference shares. Okay, now the journal will be, let us see the first journal for receiving the application amount. What is the journal? Please go back to the format and you can check it out. And last question also we have done, you can check it out. Okay, the journal will be bank account data to preference share application account being application amount received be application amount received. I am not giving much explanation because already we have done these. Okay, only when they are coming to the discount, there I will give you more explanation. Here I am going a little fast. 5000 into what is the price for application? It is 20. So how much you will get? It will be 1 lakh. The amount will be 1 lakh. Okay, now this application amount will be transferred to the capital. Okay, now the second journal, preference share, application account data to preference share capital account. Application account data to capital account. Okay, being application amount transferred, the narration will be being application amount transferred. Okay. Now what is the amount? The same amount will come. It will be 1 lakh and 1 lakh. Okay. Now the next journal. This is the important one. Allotment. View is there. Right. So that we have to inform. So when we are informing we have to show the discount also. Okay. So, the journal will be preference share allotment account data discount 
If you don't remember, then just to write down discount. If you remember, discount on issue of shares account. Okay? Discount on issue of shares. Or else discount account you write off. To reference share capital account. Being allotment due. The allotment due. Now what is the amount? How do we treat the amount? 30 rupees is allotment. 10 rupees is discount. That's what we have discussed, right? When we are calculating, do the total 30, 20, 50 plus 40, 90. So how much is less? 10 rupees. So the discount is 10 rupees. So now total how many shares were there? 5,000 into 30. 5,000 into 10. Then how much you will get? 1,50,000 and this will be 50,000. Then total 2 lakhs. Clear? Total is 2 lakhs. Now, when you receive the amount, for that you have to write down the journal. Okay? Now, bank account data to preference share allotment account. How much they will make the payment? The total allotment amount, whatever is there, that amount only they are going to pay, not more than that. Okay, because public doesn't know what is the price of them, right? So, they will be paying whatever is the informed. The allotment amount is 1,50,000, that only they are going to make the payment. Being allotment amount received. Being allotment amount received. What is the amount? 1,50,000. Don't take 2 lakhs. It is only 1,50,000. Okay. Now the next journal. Next we are writing the journal for first and final call due. Okay. Preference share first and final call account data. Preference share first and final call account data to preference share Capital account being first and final call amount due. First and final call amount due. What is the amount? 40 rupees. Right? Total how many shares? 5000 shares. 5000 into 40 we are supposed to receive 2 lakhs. This is 2 lakhs. Now, how much you are going to receive? Here we have again calls in areas. Right? So, how many shares were there? Total 5000 shares were there. In that, 500 shares have not made the payment. That means, how many shares were made the payment? 4500 only paid. Okay? Check it out. Total shares were 5500 have not paid. So, 4500 only made the payment. Now, for receiving the first and final call amount, bank account data to preference share first and final call account. What is the amount? 4500 into 40. 4500 into 40. How much you will get? It should be 1,80,000. Why 4,500? Total 5,000 shares were there. In that 500 shares were not made the payment. That means 4,500 have paid. Okay. Now the narration being first and final call amount received. Except how many shares? 500 shares. Okay. First copy this one. Copy it. Take the screenshot. Whichever is possible, please do that one. Okay. Now the journal entries were done till the calls. Now what happened here? 
500 shares were not made the payment. Now what we are going to the next step? Next we are going to we are going to write the journal for four feature. Okay, so now let's start writing the four feature journals. What are what is the journal for four feature? Already we have done in the old questions. So according to that, what is the journal for four feature? What is the amount we are writing? How many debits? How many credits? Everything you are going to check here now. Okay. Yes. And this is the seventh journal. Now the journal, preference share capital account data, total how many shares? 500 shares. What is the price? 100. Then how much? 50,000 rupees. Okay. Two, four-feeted shares account. This one you know, right? Already we have done. Two four-feeted shares account. That means how much they have paid. They paid for the allotment and they have paid for the application. Total 50 they have paid. So how much will come? 500 into 50. How much? 25,000. Okay. Next. Two. Which one they have not made the payment? First and final call they have not made the payment. Right. So two. Preference share. First and Final call account. How many shares? 500. What is the amount? 40. How much you will get? 20,000. This is what we have written in the last question, right? So is it tally? I said the debit and credit must be tally. Right? How much you have received? How much you have not received? That you mentioned. Is it tally? No. Why? This is 45 and this is 50. Why it's not tallying is we issued for the discount. So now where the discount have gone? Now where the discount have gone? So now we will get one more credit is called discount. Okay. In the last question you got two credits and one debit and here we got three credits and one debit. So please be careful when you are writing the four feature of shares. Okay. So now here to discount on issue of shares. How much? 500 into 10. It is 5000. Okay. Now the narration being four feature of shares for non-payment. Of first and final call. Please finish that one. Of first and final call. Okay. Now you are writing the next journal for reissue. Here no changes. Only this is the new thing you got. Other than that everything is same. Okay. Now for the reissue. Bank account data. Four featured shares account data. Bank account data. Four featured shares account data. Two. Preference share capital account being reissue of four feeted shares being reissue of four feature of shares. Now what is the amount for how much we have reissued? 75 rupees and it is fully paid out. Okay. So now total how many shares? 500 shares into 75. How much you will get? 500 into 75. 37,500. And here 37,500. Okay. Now we have some amount extra. So what we are going to do? We are going to transfer that to the capital reserve. Okay. Write down. Four feature of shares account. A four feature four feature shares account. Anything is fine. Okay. Four feature shares account. Data. Two capital 
रिजर्व अकाउंट बीइंग बैलेंस ट्रांसफर टू रिजर्व Being balanced transferred to reserve. Please write the whole. Now the amount. What is it? Just do the difference between them. Then you will know what is the answer. Right? What is the four features? Is sorry, I have not done fully. This is total fifteen thousand and this is twelve thousand five hundred. Sorry, how much you receive? Thirty seven thousand five hundred. What is the Amount we are not receiving that is twelve thousand five hundred and here it is total fifty thousand. Now here four features is here how much you got twenty five thousand minus here how much you have not got twelve thousand five hundred. Now that is uh, now the capital reserve will be twelve thousand five hundred. Got it? How do you transfer to the capital reserve this four feature? Minus this four feature, whatever is the balance you will take, or else we are having already the method. How much you have received in the starting twenty plus thirty fifty you have received, right? And again later reissue seventy five you have received. Total how much you have received one hundred and twenty five you have received, right? First application and allotment fifty rupees. And again at the reissue seventy five rupees. Total one twenty five you have received. What is the actual amount? Hundred. What is the extra amount? Twenty five. Total how many shares? Five hundred. Five hundred into twenty five. You will get twelve thousand five hundred. You can't remember so much. Then this four feature minus this four feature. Then you will get this one. But you can't follow that method everywhere. I mentioned already in the last video also. They may. Not paid for thousand shares, but you have reissued only five hundred shares. So that time the amount will be going wrong. So if the both the things forfeited shares and reissued shares, the total number is equal, then only we will be going with the subtraction of these two. Or else you have to follow the different method, which I have explained here. This method you have to follow. Okay. So now everyone, please copy this one, take the screenshots or whatever is possible. Please do that one. Yes, hope you understood this one, right? Yes. If you like this video, please like it, share it, and subscribe it, and please share to more and more friends of yours. Okay? Thank you very much. Bye bye.